Hey guys, I do myself here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I wanted to talk about iOS 14 developer beta 2 expected release date as well as iOS 14 public beta 1. I know a lot of you guys are anxious to install the software on your device. I also do know a lot of you guys are running uh, the first beta for iOS 14 on your devices as well. But for those of you who are looking to try iOS 14 public beta 1, I'm going to talk about expected release dates for that. And as I mentioned, expected release date for developer beta 2. Now, I have to say, iOS 14 beta 1 has been on this device installed. I've been using it as my daily device. And I haven't encountered many issues or many bugs as I did with iOS 13 beta 1. iOS 14 beta 1 is a night and day, completely different software, very stable. I've only had one crash so far after a week of using this software on my primary device that I'm using, the iPhone 11. Now, iPad OS uh, 14 beta 1 has also been very, very stable. The features are working very well as well. No crashes on iPads whatsoever. And again, only one crash, which is actually very impressive for beta 1. So let's talk about release dates for public beta. Now, Apple did say on their keynote that they will be releasing public beta 1 for iOS 14 in mid-July. So mid-July could be July 13 on up. So the 13th of July on up, public beta testers can start using iOS 14 public beta 1. And of course, I'll have links in the description if you want to try out the public beta testing program. You can sign up. It is entirely free and you can run this on either iPhones and iPads alike. Again, that's going to be public beta 1. Now, developers are usually one beta ahead. So right now, developers have beta 1. Now, beta 2 for iOS 14 for developers, and this is a very popular question. Now, if history is any indication, right, we could see the next beta for iOS 14 either the first or second week of July. So the week of the 6th or the week of the 13th, we may see iOS 14 developer beta 2. It usually takes about two to three weeks before Apple releases a new beta for a major new software update. Now, if we were talking about iOS 13.6, uh, for example, it would be maybe one week in between. But when it's a major update like iOS 14 is, it usually takes about two to three weeks. So I would say more towards the 13th week as well alongside the public beta, but it could come a little earlier on the week of the 6th. We'll have to wait and see because iOS 14 is so stable right now. I think that Apple may uh, speed up the process here a little bit, although the software won't be released to everyone worldwide until later in September, maybe early October, depending on when the new iPhones get released. The software will most likely continue to be improved upon. I mean, just so many features that have been added and uh, it's just very, very stable. You guys are going to be very happy if you want to try it out. Public beta, again, the links will be in the description. Developers, you can expect this in the next couple of weeks, as I mentioned as well, alongside public beta on the week of the 13th, most likely. So thank you for watching today's video, guys. Let me know your experience so far with iOS 14. Have a great day and I'll see you real soon. Peace.